Middle East, despite the recent economic slowdown in many developed countries. When I think back on those early days, I can say that I did have a pretty big dream. In one of our early planning sessions, my vision was to create the largest food company in the world. That was when we had just five stores. Some people, I'm sure, thought I was overly optimistic. Well, we're still far from achieving it, but we do have over 2,600 stores today, composed of Jollibee, Greenwich, Chow King, Red Ribbon, Manginasal, Burger King Philippines, Yonghe King, Hong Zhuang Yan, San Ping Wang in China, Highlands Coffee and 424 in Vietnam, and we are growing faster today than ever before. Here are some pictures of our local brands and our brands in China. I guess one lesson from this experience is you have to dream big. After all, dreams are free, so why limit what you aspire to? But dreaming is not enough. One must be willing to put in the needed action and hard work to make these dreams come true. Now let me name some sort of our brands that you may not be so familiar with. Brands like Mary's Chicken and Copenhagen Ice Cream. These are brands that we started and failed to grow. If you dream big and put your dreams into action, you will inevitably make mistakes. But don't be scared to make mistakes. Just be quick in realizing the mistake and correcting them as best and as fast as you can. Learn from each mistake and it will not be a waste of your time. Coupled with this belief, I also believe that we should give our fellow men more than they expect, whether they be customers, co-workers, suppliers, families, or friends. I think that comes from a view that we don't have to be greedy in our daily lives or business. If we strike the right balance, we share the benefits with whomever we're dealing. Surprisingly, there always seems to be more than enough to go around for everyone. We at Jollibee Foods Corporation have so much to thank for. And as our company grew, so did our potential for reaching more people in more ways. This was the reason the Jollibee Foundation was established in 2004 to make giving back an organized corporate commitment. Our Busog Lusog Talino, or BLT school feeding program, that the Jolby Foundation started five years ago to address hunger among grades one and two pupils and help them stay in school. It has already benefited over 100,000 pupils nationwide. The Farmer Entrepreneurship Program launched in 2008 to improve small farmers' income by linking them to the supply chain of institutional markets like Jolby Foods Corporation has already benefited more than 400 farmers across the country. We also provide immediate assistance to families affected by strong typhoons in the past, as well as assisting the Jolby Gawat Kalinga villages in Las Piñas, Southern Leyte, and Butuan. As I reflected back on what I've been saying to you today, I noticed it all comes back to ourselves, our state of mind, and our values and beliefs. Think back on the three examples I mentioned at the beginning of my talk today, Leo Oracion, Barack Obama, Benigno Aquino III. Think of their states of mind, their mindsets. If we place no restrictions on ourselves, then we are capable of doing anything. If we are not greedy, then more things will return to us. If we give more to our fellow men and to our customers than they expect, they return over and over again. So to you all who are these nations and this world's current and future entrepreneurs, leaders, and innovators, see if you can find that state of mind and feel it because with this in your arsenal, anything is possible. If you can feel it and live it, you will know how to create a beautiful future for yourselves and for your country. If we believe in our dream, and pursue it with passion and discipline, then whatever the dream may be, we can achieve it. 
If we pursue it to the best of ability, we don't need to worry about the outcome because the outcome will take care of itself. It is within our own power to make our dreams a reality. They are not created by anyone other than ourselves. So my dear audience, you're in the driver's seat to create your own future. And by creating your future, you're also creating the future of your land and our land. Seize the moment and make your entrepreneurial dreams come true. Thank you and God bless you all.